Welcome to the program. Today I want to discuss with you the topic of can there be ethics outside of religion? This is a topic of vast significance and as many of us know, the world is confronted with the challenges of religious values vis-a-vis -vis secular values. So when we talk about can there be ethics outside of religion, it might be good even to start with the concept of ethics in itself. As you know, ethics covers the following dilemmas, how to live a good life, our rights and responsibilities, the language of right and wrong, moral decisions of what is good and bad. At its simplest, therefore, ethics is a system of moral principles, how people make decisions and live their lives. What we've seen is that because religion claims supernatural and transcendental value and authority, religion comes from above to give moral guidance to people in society. Humanity has come a long way traditional societies, cultures have developed and most of them have mixed with belief systems that try to ground morality in the divine, in God. Now, in recent times, a strong tendency has started of free thinkers, of humanists, of utilitarians, of consequentialists, even of atheists. And the question stands to ask, can these persons who don't belong to any religious tradition, who do not even believe in God, are they able to live an ethical life? The answer, of course, is yes. You can be ethical outside of religion. Because ethics is founded and grounded, first of all, on principles of human reasoning. And human reasoning is not given only to those who believe. Human reasoning is given to entire humanity because of their identity as being human, created rationally. What is the right thing to do is a rational question. Religions answer it for you ahead. They tell you the right thing to do is don't take what belongs to another. They codify it even in laws and commandments. But ethics generally will try to ground it in rational thinking. What ought I do? How does it impact on the larger society? Is it good to do things that contradict the common good? Religion can help, but not always. Ethics, therefore, for those who come from secular, from atheist, from outside of the religious traditions points of view, like the consequentialists or the utilitarians, they have an ability to think religion, to think ethically and also even to act ethically. Somehow one must even say that if someone would act ethically beyond the reasons of religion, that person is perhaps more ethical. If I would not steal because I knew that if I stole, I shall go to hell, or if I stole, I will be put in prison. I am acting because of the consequence of what may happen. That is not ethical enough. But if I said, I will not steal because it is wrong for me not to steal and I will not want anybody to take what is mine, I will make the norms of my own behavior to become a universal category like Immanuel Kant the famous German philosopher will advocate, one will see that ethics is a system of behavior, of morality, of right conduct that can be grounded in religion, but also can be grounded in secular thinking. Ethics is made for man. And as more as humanity becomes ethical, within, beyond, with, without religion, we build a better society. Welcome. Thank you. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are.